Hello and welcome to the Black Gold Homestead. On today's video, we're going to be talking about goat hair. Come with me. When raising goats, when raising goats, it's always a good idea. When raising goats, it's always a good idea to have a shelter, a nice um, shelter that protects them from the wind, the rain, and the snow. It can be a simple three-sided shelter like this, and they will do just fine. The breed that I have and that I like the best is the Nigerian Dwarf. They are nice little goats, and they're really friendly, and they have pretty good milk production. What I feed my goats, especially in the winter, is a all-stock sweet feed pellet. And in addition, I give them black oil sunflower seeds, which are really good for their health. I will also add in some whole corn and some alfalfa pellets on occasion. Always, always, always put diatomaceous earth in your feed. It is a great natural dewormer and it helps to get rid of many problems. And a lot of times people do say that goats have parasite issues, but I have been using this and it works for all of my animals. And you can just sprinkle it on the food, like so. Just sprinkle it on the top. Mix it in. And they will eat it and they will be happy with it. Also, you can take your diatomaceous earth and sprinkle it on the floor of your barn and that will help with parasite issues. Okay, now it's time for you all to meet our goats. Behind me here is our male Nigerian dwarf goat, Biscuit. Also, I forgot to mention, but it's very important that you always give your goats a fresh, clean source of hay. And as you can see, he is nice and small. They're a very small breed and they're very friendly and he was a bottle baby. Here's what their hay looks like. It's just a regular grass hay and it's not too dusty. And that is the main bulk of their diet. Also, you will want to make sure that they have fresh, clean water every day. and a salt block. All right. This is Meadow. And as you can see, she is pregnant. And she's gonna get up on the stand and eat some of her food. And this is Magnolia, who is also bred and pregnant. At the most, I will get about a quart of milk per milking from her, and you milk them twice a day. As you can see, they are very friendly, and they like to get on to the milk stand. And it's important to work with them from a young age. Also behind me here is our Donkey Dominic. Donkeys are good to have because they can actually protect the goats and help to keep them safe. So this is Meadow and the little one is Magnolia. Thanks for watching. Bye.